Hello my fellow felines, this is Kitty Cat plays in the yard here, and welcome to another speed build. And today I am building a apartment. Uh, and it is the apartment in 17 Culpeper House, which is in the Spice District of San Myshuno, if in case you were curious. And this apartment, um, there's no not necessarily a real theme to it. But if I had to give it a theme, I would say it's like, it's just kind of traditional and pretty basic. Um, like the cabinets are clearly kind of older and the doors are older and like all the like appliances and plumbing, you can tell it's kind of an older apartment, but like the, the person that moved in brought like their own things. And I imagine the person that actually lives here is like, fresh out of university or like in the middle of university so they don't have much uh you'll see like when we get more into it but this person doesn't really have a lot of decorations in their apartment and that's because they're they're living on a budget and that's okay um that's more than okay uh i do it eh, all my life <laughs> i've done it all my life uh but this this person doesn't really have a lot, and uh, like I said, I imagine they're enrolled in university or just got out of university. Uh, but there is a computer in this build. I put the base game laptop in here because my past few builds haven't had any computers in them, uh, and I don't really know why I've been doing that. I think I've just kind of been spacing on them. Maybe or maybe not because I've been a bit inebriated every time I've been recording lately. But, um, that's none of your business. <laughs> um, speaking of being inebriated, I am drinking a can of rosé. Uh, that's pretty nice, and I'm excited about it. Um, uh, but right now we are working on just kind of getting things laid down right now. Uh, the bedroom is actually split-leveled. Split-leveled? Is that, is that how you say that? I don't know. Um, but the bedroom has a platform in it, um, and that's where, like, the sleeping space is. And then the kitchen is actually, I can't remember if I raised it or if I sunk it, but I raised it or sunk it once, uh, just so, I don't know, because I wanted to. I, I don't have to give you a reason. Um, and then, like I said, the bedroom is as well. And, um, yeah, I don't really know what else to say about this build. It's been a little while since I've actually done a voiceover, and it's been a little while since I've done this build, <laughs> so uh, not too long. It's only been like a week or so since I've done it, but uh, still, it's not necessarily the freshest thing in my mind, so I'm a little lost as to what to say. Um, but we're just kind of putting <laughs> random stuff in the living room. And like I said, um, I imagine this, this person's like fresh out of university, they don't have much money or whatever. Uh, and so that's why a lot of their stuff doesn't necessarily match. Um, you know, like the couch and the chair don't match and the couch isn't necessarily the best couch. Uh, I used the one that I think you can get from the flea market in San Myshuno. Uh, I, I actually really like it uh, just for like these kinds of purposes. Um, and then the side table they have here also looks run down and the chair is one of the like repurposed ones from what's it called eco lifestyle uh so i thought that fit pretty well um and we just have kind of like lots of random decorations like it it looks good but it's not necessarily on theme at all like this person just kind of has their things and they put them where they wanted to like it doesn't matter they're not necessarily super worried about interior design if that makes any sense uh, and here we are working on the bedroom and i ended up using this carpet from discovery university i really like it a lot um, and i think i've only gotten the chance to use it like once or twice so i thought uh this was a good place to use it uh i don't know if it necessarily fits really well with the apartment but i think it looks good so that's pretty much the only reason it's still there let me know what you think of <laughs> that carpet in this apartment in terms of how it fits. Because I, I definitely don't think it fits at all. Like, it doesn't make sense. But, 
I don't know. I thought it, it looked good, so I kept it. Anyway, <laughs> I need to stop rambling. Uh, we're just cluttering up the bedroom space a little bit. Not too much, uh, because like I said, I imagine the Sim doesn't have much money, blah, blah, blah. Uh, oh, I did put, I don't know if you noticed or not, it was pretty quick, but in the living room, I actually did put a knit, uh, oh, words are hard, a knitting basket next to one, uh, or next to the chair, because, um, I don't know, I feel like other than my very specific, oh, this is a grandma build, I never put knitting anywhere, and I've also never played with the knitting much, uh, because I don't play much, you guys know that, uh, <laughs> but I never put it anywhere, so I decided I was going to put it in this house, and I also used uh, that clutter from Nifty Knitting as well on the dresser, because, um, I don't know, I imagine this person really likes to knit, so that was kind of my thoughts there. And, uh, is this the desk I keep? I can't remember, but this is also a nifty knitting item. Uh, because apparently I was really in the mood to use nifty knitting. I also grabbed, uh, the purple lava lamp from Strangerville because I thought that fit really well. Uh, this kind of, like I said, I know it doesn't necessarily have a theme, but the color scheme in the bedroom is, like, very purple and aqua. Um, and then I added some cat things because I saw that cat bed and I was like, well, <laughs> I'm gonna add a cat. And so I'm just putting a cat tree in the living room. And, um, oh, and I put this little cat mirror because, I don't know, I just, I thought it was so cute. Uh, and I figured this is like one of the types of things this person would have. So I was like, yeah, I gotta. And now we're finally moving on to the kitchen. Uh, it's very simple. I don't remember what counters I used. I can't remember if I kept these ones or not. Uh, did I? Oh, yes, I did. Uh, so I used the kitchen, uh, cool kitchen counters, uh, which I hardly ever use because, frankly, I just don't like them that much. I did when they first came out, but now I just, I don't care. Um, <laughs> That's awful. I'm, I'm a bad person. Uh, but uh, the kitchen, like I said, is very basic. Um, I end up putting some wall tile down that... Uh, mm, I don't know what to say about it. I don't like it, but I think it's fitting for an apartment like this. I feel like it's fitting for an old apartment. Uh, I kind of hate it. I really kind of hate it a lot. Like. The tiles not matching, like floor tiles and ceiling, uh, floor tiles and wall tiles not matching. But um, I, I just it it's so real. Like I've seen houses like that, so I I, I had to. Uh, but just adding a little bit of clutter on the counters, not a lot, uh, because like I've said a million times, I imagine the Sim doesn't have much money, therefore they don't have a lot of stuff. Uh, uh, yeah, I don't really know what else to talk about. Um, because frankly, I'm just kind of super out of it today, but I needed to get this video done. Oh, um, I want to apologize for not having a video on Friday. Uh, I wish I had a better excuse, but like honestly, things just got away from me, so <laughs> that's why. But you guys did end up getting two videos last week because uh, the paranormal stuff trailer came out and I reacted to that, uh, so you got uh, I believe a speed build on Monday and then the reaction to that trailer on Tuesday so I know they were like very close together or whatever but uh, at least you still got two uploads uh, like I said I'm sorry but uh, life just kind of got got ahead of me and uh, that's okay like, I, I'm not beating myself up for it and if, like don't so don't worry that you think I am or not um, but no I'm just kind of I thought I'd mention it. Uh, I'm not dead. Hello. <laughs> well, if, if you follow me on Twitter, linked in the description down below, by the way, uh, you would know that I'm not dead. Uh, like I said, it, it just got away from me. Um, but yeah, anyway, we're adding some final touches, and I think we are going to be coming to the end very shortly. We have some screenshots for you at the end. Um, but anyway, I am going to go, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye, friends.
If you like this one, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and check out some other videos of mine while you're on it.